I didn't know who else to call. You call me. You always call me. Me. Right? Oh, um. Hang on. I'm glad you're back. Obviously, I'm glad. What I mean to say is, it's been horrible. Like losing my best mate. But now we can get over it, make it like it was before. Hi. Hey. Never asked if you were hungry. You must be by now. We're going to have to talk about what happened. I know it's not nice, but we've got to do it. Where is she? Do you even know? Did you have a fight? Look, Jake, <laughs> you do not owe that woman anything. Not loyalty, not sympathy, especially not sympathy. What? That woman. Jake, she left you with no money and no phone. What does that tell you? What it tells me is if you hadn't stuck your nose in, carried on texting me, we'd still be together. Do you actually think that? You got what you want. Oh, Jake, you really can't see, can you? Wanna know what I can see? What? Doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter what. Well, I can see somebody angry and embarrassed, vindictive because he had his girlfriend stolen off him. But don't blame her. Blame me. I'm sorry we did this to you. Look, the fact that you've come back is brilliant means that you've realised that you and Maya... that there can't be a you and Maya. She's an adult woman and having feelings for someone your age is just not right. It's not normal. You can see that, can't you, Jake? What do you want me to say? I want the truth. I want all the details so I can understand the whole picture. I've said I'm sorry. I never set out to steal her off you. This wasn't your fault. No, will you stop saying that? I knew exactly what I was doing. I'd text her right in front of you. Me to hear, blatant, knowing you could walk in on us, but we didn't care. So I should done a runner, Jack. I've told you, it's you. Phoning all the time, stressing her out. You wouldn't leave us alone. Hiding, holed up in some hotel, starving by the looks of things. We had each other, and that was enough. You didn't get very far. Should we try again? We're closed. Oh, look who's come back to us. What did you see? You have now. Are you all right? Of course he is. And you are going to put the biggest smile on your granddad's face. Well, it's Amber's party now, so come on. Yeah, we'll be over in a bit. <laughs> Oh, couldn't stand the pace. <laughs> hey, look who I was about to drag over. Uh, Faith, uh, could you give us a moment? It's OK, since you made me aware of the Jacob situation, my strategy, as always, is to play things normal. <laughs> Can I, uh, may I get a hug? Hey! I said not to push him. Hey! Hey! Eric! Oh! Oh, well... Great work, David. That went really well. Get your dad a chair. 